Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Poiggy here, getting ready to take out the Italian Reserved Aircraft CR-32 and Air Realistic. Um, what do I know about it? So I was playing, uh, what's the one before it? The Row 44. These 50 cals, I believe they're the same ones, right? We're doing Breda Safford. Yeah, they hit hard. So we have tons of ammo. We've got 700 rounds of 50 cals. Um, it should climb relatively well. I mean, it's a reserve aircraft, but climb relatively well. I think the roll rate's a little bit slow, but um, maybe it doesn't hold energy real well. It's a biplane, but uh, if we just get some energy at the start of the match, we should be good. So let's take it out and see what we can do. All right, the map is Bastogne. stone. We've got our stealth ammo, 800 meter targeting distance, minimum fuel load, and we're good to go. See what we're here with, HE-51. Looking like a lonely game. Yeah, 6v6 so far, so... <laughs> we've got four bombers. Alright, so they got Murica and British. I'm gonna go ahead and try and get our speed up to 125 and then climb at that rate. Alright, so the climb rate is pretty bad on this thing, but make it work. All right, looks like we're sticking to 6v6, so hopefully we can hit a lot of ground units. Let's see, our airfield's pointing us this way, they're pointing that way. Might go off a little bit to the right. I'm going to go towards their third base there. Third base is fun. Uh, they got a bomber up high, just one that I see, which means the fighter that I have with me and I are going to be busy with their fighters. We likely have five of them. Lots of ground targets if we can take care of the air enough to uh, focus on grounds. Oh good, second bomber on their side. And we'll just continue our climb, try to get some energy. So our Stuka... Two Stukas and S81, SM79. So I think the S81 and the SM79 can put some hurt on their uh, on their bases, but Stukas maybe not so much. And they can have a thousand kilogram bomb, I guess. Hopefully that's what they brought. All right, so I'm expecting to see them a little bit to my left, so somewhere around here. There's their airfield. Should be climbing towards us. Still 6v6. Oh, I love that line of vehicles. Alright, two in front. They're climbing. Rather, they weren't. They look like they're working together somewhat. He's going to wing rip, I think. Yeah, it wasn't looking too healthy. Alright, P36 and two F3Fs. Not what we want to see in front of us. We need to get our speed up. That F3F has an energy advantage. Where's our buddy? Let's drag him over to our buddy. Has an energy advantage and he can outmaneuver us. The only thing we can do better is we've got better guns. So let's just keep building our energy up. Hope they get bored and do something stupid. Now while we have their F3F and that P36 uh, decided to give up their energy, I want to head their direction. See if we can take advantage of them being low. They're way too close to their uh, airfield, unfortunately. The F3F is grabbing dinner. All right, 
Alright, so if our Stuka can keep them busy long enough and away from their airfield, he put us in a really good position to come help him out and uh, take out two planes we need out of the game. Sure shit doing his best. Watching their airfield just to make sure I don't get uh, start getting shot at. Things deadly accurate. At least at this level. You're in a jet, they're not so bad. Alright, we're going to give up our altitude and dive in. Don't want to rip, so we'll just cut our engine off. Want to slot in behind. He's still keeping them busy. Gotta give him credit. Alright, let's get this going. 36 first. He's down. F3F next. Focused on our buddy. Not almost shooting at him. He's down. Alright, we're gonna look for the line of vehicles on their side. Not worried about the Hampton. There it is. It's usually a nice easy way to rack up some points. Just got to make sure the AA doesn't do a bunch of damage to us in the process. Focus on the AAs first. Go through our first straight front. couple. Stay low for a second. Flip back around. F3F is in the game again. Looks like he got his nachos. Alright, vertical turn. Try to save some energy back after these AAs. Try not to high-five the tree. Alright, still 400 rounds. Vehicles are easy to kill than the AAs. Apparently, though. Do you struggle a little bit with the uh, lining up these 50s? I still like the stealth ammo, but I nice to see if I'm missing low or high. I think it's usually low. Cleaning up, plenty of ammo still. Saw their F3F go back to land, that's fine. Not a concern at the moment. How does that not kill these guys? It's odd to me. Definitely used to. You just put like a 7 mil into a vehicle and they were done. Both my guns are in the nose, so the targeting distance shouldn't matter at all. Hmm. Oh well, figure it out one day. In the meantime, we'll just shoot the shit out of them.
One more, we should be cleaned up back here. All right, took care of that objective. Got 170 rounds left. I think uh, just go ahead and keep hitting grounds rather than go back and reload. We're gonna get low, try and stay under where the A will shoot at us, even though it seems like it's already started. And just keep everybody getting more points. Ooh, hi. I think we uh, go ahead and focus on AAs. They don't count towards us winning. But they do count towards getting points and staying in the game. If you hit them. 100 rounds. Target of the blind hunt. That's fine. Well, the Hampton wants it. Let's go, buddy. That's some for you. Does he really need those blind hunt dollars? Alright, we're out of ammo. RTB. Get low. Try to stay out of trouble. All right, I'll check back in with you guys once we're uh, rearmed, refueled, and uh, repaired. All right, so that did it. So we ended up winning on our way back to uh, rearm, refuel, and reload at the base. Let's see, we ended up with three air targets, 19 ground targets. We got a talisman for, I don't know, one of the tanks. Uh, I think one of the reserves. Ended up getting Thunder and Mission Maker. Nice first and final blow and first place on the team. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch on next one. America! Fuck yeah! To say this fucking day, yeah! Beautiful.